Look, it's number blocks two and four. What are you standing on? We're standing on a tin lunchbox filled with dinosaurs that walk on two legs. And you can also find dinosaurs in here that walk on four legs. Wow, there are dinosaurs in this lunchbox? Whoa, look at the ferocious Tyrannosaurus Rex. Let's open the box and sort the dinosaurs based on how they walk. On two legs or four legs. Let's find out how many dinosaurs are inside. Here's the latch to open the box. Wow, look at all the different colors. Let's take a closer look at this purple one. This dinosaur is called a Pachycephalosaurus. Pachycephalosaurus means thick-headed lizard. This dinosaur walked on two legs. An animal that walks on two legs is a bipedal animal. You can also say it's a biped. Let's place the bipeds next to number block two. Do you know the name of this red dinosaur? This dinosaur is called the Triceratops. The Triceratops was a fascinating dinosaur with its three horns and a frill on its head. As you can see, the Triceratops walks on four legs. An animal that walks on four legs is called a quadrupedal or quadruped for short. Let's place all the quadrupeds next to number block four. Let's get the next dinosaur. This is an Allosaurus. The Allosaurus had sharp teeth and claws which it used to hunt and capture its prey. Is the Allosaurus a biped or a quadruped? The Allosaurus was a bipedal dinosaur. Wow, look at this green dinosaur. This is the Spinosaurus. Can you guess why it's called a Spinosaurus? It's because this dinosaur had big spine bones. The Spinosaurus is one of the largest meat-eating dinosaurs ever discovered. The Spinosaurus is a bipedal dinosaur. It walked on two legs. Look at this blue dinosaur. It has so many plates on its back. This is a Stegosaurus. The Stegosaurus had a unique feature. Its back was adorned with large bony plates. And look at the spiky tail. Those long spikes are called thagomizers. It may have used its tail to protect itself from predators. The Stegosaurus was an herbivore, which means it ate plants. Do you remember what an animal that walks on four legs is called? A quadruped. The Stegosaurus was a quadrupedal dinosaur. This is one of the most famous dinosaurs of all time. This is the Tyrannosaurus Rex, or T-Rex for short. The T-Rex was an incredible dinosaur that roamed the earth millions of years ago. It was one of the largest meat-eating dinosaurs that ever lived. The Tyrannosaurus Rex could grow up to 40 feet long. Despite its massive size, 
The T-Rex had very short arms. The T-Rex was a biped. It walked on two legs. This gray dinosaur is called Diplodocus. The Diplodocus was an amazing dinosaur that lived in the late Jurassic period. Diplodocus was an herbivorous dinosaur, meaning it only ate plants. It had a long neck and a small head to help it reach leaves on tall trees. Diplodocus was one of the longest dinosaurs ever discovered. Some Diplodocus could grow up to 90 feet long. As you can see, Diplodocus moves with four legs. That means it's a quadruped. Let's place the quadrupedal dinosaur next to number block four. This is a Velociraptor. The Velociraptor was known for its agility and speed. Velociraptors had a unique feature, a sharp curved claw on each foot. It's called a sickle claw. They used this claw for capturing prey and possibly for climbing. The Velociraptor was a biped. It moved using two legs. This green dinosaur covered in armor is called Ankylosaurus. The name Ankylosaurus means fused or stiff lizard. The Ankylosaurus was heavily armored with bony plates and had spikes and knobs on its body. To defend itself, the Ankylosaurus had a club-like tail with a solid mass of bone at the end. Ankylosaurus moved around on four legs. It was a quadruped. This is a Brachiosaurus. The Brachiosaurus was one of the tallest and largest dinosaurs ever discovered. It could reach heights of over 40 feet and weigh around 80 tons. Despite its massive size, the Brachiosaurus had a relatively small head and a brain about the size of a banana. The Brachiosaurus was a quadrupedal dinosaur. This dinosaur is the Parasaurolophus. One unique feature of the Parasaurolophus was its distinct head crest. This crest was a long, curved, tube-like structure that extended from its skull and likely played a role in producing sounds, possibly for communication or display purposes. Parasaurolophus was an herbivorous dinosaur, meaning it primarily ate plants. Parasaurolophus was a bipedal dinosaur. The last dinosaur is a Styracosaurus. It had a large horn on its nose and several smaller horns protruding from its frill. These horns likely serve for defense and display making the Styracosaurus an impressive sight. The Styracosaurus was about 18 to 20 feet long and weighed around three to four tons. It had a sturdy body and moved about with four strong legs, making it a quadrupedal dinosaur. Today, we learned about six bipedal dinosaurs or dinosaurs that walk on two legs. We also found six quadrupedal dinosaurs, or dinosaurs that walk with four legs. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please make sure to give us a thumbs up and subscribe.